today I'm answering a little craving. I was craving some chicken, some fried chicken, and um, I decided on churches. Um, yeah, so far churches has been my favorite out of all the fried chickens than the original. I went ahead and got the spicy, and it's got the spicy mayo on there and the pickles, and it's just a nice soft bun. But I wanted to give that a try before I got into the chicken. So, first of all, the breast doesn't look as, well, the, I guess it, yeah, that's a breast. Mm. Mm. Cause they've got that little honey glaze on there. Mm. Mm. Ooh. I used to say Popeyes had the best because they're so buttery. These aren't so buttery, but they have that nice crispy glaze on the top and it's really tasty. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Hey you guys, what's up? So, today I'm back with an Indian food feast and I've never had Indian food before, I know, crazy. So, when I try to tell you everything, I'm probably gonna mispronounce, so let's just be honest. Um, I'm gonna try to read it off, but you guys, I'm so excited. I've been getting requests of it and... Mmm. So, I don't know if there's a huge difference between butter chicken and chicken tiki masala. Let me know if there is. From what I could tell by the menu, how they wrote their menu at least, is the chicken's different. Wow. Whatever this is, it's red. That one's really good. If you guys know what sauce that is, let me know. I'm going to try this dessert. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Now this is a samosa. And I think you're supposed to dip these in chutney. Mmm. I'm sorry, you can't remember what it's called. Now I'm gonna try this chicken tandoorini. And this is a super popular like appetizer. I'm really excited. I'm gonna dip it in that sauce. Welcome back to our channel. I'm Dill. I'm and before we get much today, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell to be notified when we drop goodies like these. Welcome back. It's such a treat. Great play, fam. Come on. Let's eat. Let's pray. Father God, we thank you for everyone that's joining us today. T bones. We got a bit of cheese steak. Uh huh. Add jerk sauce. Mm hmm. Uh, jerk chicken. Extra jerk sauce. Bit of cheese steak. And with well, uh, that cheese steak, but Philly. Yeah. And uh John Gotti. Hoagie. Yeah. You got what's that John on? Gotti. Here's the herb. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It doesn't happen like that every time though. The thing that you added the last minute mm -hmm. be the one that catch that catch you. My late night snack, cause you know I'm probably not gonna sleep, so. Yeah. Shot the T-bone. They even wrote a little note on our packaging. We love y'all too. Y'all good people down there. And y'all snapping. Looking good. 
The Lord for Jesus. Mm. But they should. Mm. It's good. Mm -hmm. I feel like I just said that. <laughs> So of course, that's, we, a, that's the only thing that's missing. Of course, we call the acid, but where's the fun mm -hmm. in that? In tomatoes, and the, mm -hmm. um, excuse me, because it's only chicken, cheese, and onions. Uh -huh. That's the only thing that's on the um. And the, mushrooms. The Flipwood. Puba. Puba. Hana, two, three. Whoa. Huh? Mexican restaurant called La Esperanzas. It's so bomb. I've eaten it on my channel before. It's just so bomb. So I have a carne asada taco. I have rice, beans, a cheese enchiladas. Uh, these are called SP chips. They're just uh, chips with um, chili verde. Mmm. So good. Mmm. And I filmed. Mm. That night after she left, um, I was sitting outside and I was smoking. And it's wagging its tail. And he's like, it's nice. So I'm sitting on um on one of the chairs and you know, the dog follows him over and <sighs> she was eating, she was wagging her tail. She was sweet. No. I'm like, somebody has to be looking for her. We brought her inside. Fed her. Um, 